What's good, YouTube? Welcome back to another video. This is Marketing with Dev. Make sure you guys give me a like, comment, subscribe, and hit those bell notifications so you can be notified when I drop new videos just like this one. And in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to set up a traffic campaign. But before we get into that, if you're serious about using Facebook ads to grow your business, I'm hosting a free live workshop where I'll walk you through the exact ad formula that's generated over $10 million in sales since 2020. This isn't theory. I'm showing you step-by-step step how to launch ads that actually bring in qualified leads, even if you don't have a huge budget or a fancy funnel. And spots are limited. I'm trying to keep this small, no more than maybe 25 or 30 people, just because when, when it's too many people, it gets harder to actually give you individualized help. So make sure you grab your seat right now. The link is in the description. But with that out of the way, let's get into this tutorial. So the first thing that you're gonna wanna do is be in the ads manager, of course. And once we're here, this is the dashboard. We're gonna go to the left right here and we're going to select this green create button. And here we see all of the different campaign objectives and we are going to go with traffic for this one, right? So what is a traffic campaign? So the way Facebook describes it is send people to a destination like your website, app, Instagram profile, or Facebook event. And it's good for link clicks, landing page views, Instagram profile visits, Messenger, Instagram, and WhatsApp and calls, right? So I have used traffic campaigns before to test some things and I've tested pretty much all of these objectives just because you need to know how they perform. And what I've noticed the most about traffic campaigns is that you will get a lot of link clicks, but it's not necessarily qualified people, right? You will have a lot of uh, clicks, but not too many landing page views and you won't get as many conversions, at least in my experience. But I have used traffic campaigns to test some things. So I'm gonna show you guys how we can set this up. So we're gonna select it, continue, manual traffic campaign. So the one, just call this example, and then traffic. So first thing we're gonna do is always name our campaign, right? So we always name our campaign because we always want to know what we're looking at when we are out in the dashboard. And the way we name our campaign is simple. If it is a cold campaign or a campaign that's going to people who have never heard of us before, then it is going to be labeled L1. If it's retargeting or if the ad or the campaign is going to an audience that have seen us or interacted with us in some way before, then that will be labeled L2. In the middle, we always have the objective, like what we're actually trying to accomplish with the campaign. So if this was a book calls campaign, if I was trying to get book calls, I would just get, I would just put book calls there. Or if I was selling, I don't know, a baked apple pie, then I would just put, you know, apple pie sales or whatever the case is, right? Whatever you're, you're trying to do, you put that in the middle. And at the end, we always just have the type of objective of the campaign that we're doing. And we're using traffic, right? So this is gonna be a traffic campaign. So that's how we name it like that and then we can go to next and now we're taken to the ad set level always want to name the ad set level um as well just for this example just want to show you guys how to set up a campaign let's just say i'm doing a broad audience age 18 through 65. so choose your conversion location so you're either going to select from website message destinations instagram or facebook or calls so those are the places that you can drive your traffic to. So depending on how you have your business set up, it's going to be depending on how you would um, select this. So for me personally, I would probably be doing website just because that's how my stuff is set up. Performance goals, we want to maximize the number of link clicks because traffic campaign, that is what the campaign is, right? We want link clicks, right? So you're going to connect your Facebook page, set up your budget. Um, I would recommend starting at ad sets at least 20 bucks a day just so you can get a good enough spend to get good data but you don't want to overspend initially either and i found that 20 dollars for an ad set let that run for three to five days typically is a good amount going down to advantage plus audience and things like that we're not going to be doing that but for locations right so I'm leaving broad audience. I'm in the United States, so I'm selecting the United States. If I was in a different country, if you're in a different country watching this, you can select whichever country you want. Or if you do business in other countries, you can select those countries too. That is totally up to you. And then we're going to now go to the ad level. And what we're gonna do here is, again, name this. So we're going to, let's just call this ad one, right? 
just gonna be an example. Just wanna show you guys how to set up this campaign. Ad setup, uh, let's create ad, right? Single image or video, ad creative. You would go here, you guys will upload whatever image or video you're using. And then you will also go there to put in your copy and things like that as well, right? So set up, say it's an image, right? We have our stuff in here. Let's just do this for an example. Okay, next, right? We'll put our copy here, put our headline here, call to action. And then we would be done. And there you go, right? And when you're done, you would select publish in the bottom right. Facebook will review your campaign. And if they say it's good to go, you will be good to go, right? Hope you guys enjoyed this video. But before we get out of here, like I said earlier, if you guys are serious about learning Facebook ads and you want a proven strategy, no guesswork, no theory of how you can start generating more leads and sales for your business using Facebook ads, then click the link in the description and register for my free live workshop, right? See you guys there. Thank you guys for watching this video and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.